Hola a todos, aquí Diero estamos en Mass Effect 3 y bueno, vamos a ver, me sale aquí una opción que es para llamar a Vega. No sé para qué, mm, si sí. sí, el rollete de, de Shepard es eh, el Diara. Si sigue vivo. You want your own ship, Vega? Yeah, maybe one day. When I'm old and I can't fight worth shit anymore. You just come up here to make fun of your commander. Sorry, love. Tu, 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 tu. I guess maybe I got some things on my mind. I, I wanted to get your opinion on something. Shoot. What did you do when they asked you to join the N7 program? I mean, was it a no-brainer for you, or did you think about it before accepting? The N7 program is a big deal, but it's also a big commitment. I hear that. You get the best training, best equipment, best assignments. And they expect the best in return. Yes, they do. Why are you asking? Well, even all the shit that's going on, somebody somewhere managed to track me down and forward an N7 commendation. It's dated the same day the Reapers attacked Earth. You don't sound too thrilled. Well, aside from the fact that there won't be an N7 program if we don't win this war, I just... Being a soldier is the only thing I've ever been really good at. And not because I try. I lot to kick my ass out years ago. Last time I had a command, I lost almost everyone. And they promoted me for it. I guess I'm just not sure if I'm ready to lead again. I don't know if I want that responsibility. You mentioned that before. What went wrong? What didn't go wrong? We were out on patrol, checking on some strange readings. Then the collectors hit. But they hit the colony first. By the time we got back, most of the colonists had been subdued or abducted, including our CO, Captain Tony. So you were in charge? Yeah. We laid low for a bit, waiting for a chance to strike. But before we could, we were betrayed. One of the colonists turned out to be a Cerberus spy working with the Collectors. I had no choice. I killed him and destroyed the Collector ship. But it got ugly. We lost most of the colonists and all but one of my squad. Not exactly a textbook operation. You can't blame yourself for being put in a tough situation. And if you were promoted, then something must have gone right. Sure, but... If you'd saved them all, would things have worked out better? I... I don't know. I don't think so. The right choice is usually not the easy one. Yeah. Did you know that before you joined the N7? Yep. That's why I was asked. And it's why they asked you. There is not a single N7 that hasn't sacrificed either themselves or their soldiers at some point. So you think I should accept? Assuming we survive right. this, that's a no-brainer. You're a damn good soldier, Vega. Don't waste that opportunity. I'll think about it. Seriously. If you don't mind, maybe don't mention this to anyone else. Of course My not. Gracias. Well, I think I better get back to the hangar. Things here it's a little too soft for me. The bed's a lot harder than it looks. Are you flirting with me, Lola? Mm, I'm going. No. Thanks again, Shepard. Anytime. No sé por qué suelta eso Shepard, pero vale, debería darte la opción. Vale, Kaidan la tenemos ya en el equipo. Vale, no hay más correos. Venga, pues vámonos a hacer millonzillas. No, mierda, de tal que no era. Ah, sí, sí. Ah. Siempre me llaman para algo. Por aquí no puedo bajar ni nada. Es allí al fondo, ¿no? 
A ver qué quiere ahora el Anderson. Shepard. I was hoping you'd check in again. You okay? Been putting my old academy training to use. Organizing the resistance. You know you've got quite a fan club back here. Any news we hear about the Normandy gives hope to the guys in the trenches. I know what that's like fighting in the dark. I'm glad we're making a difference. It's more than that. A lot of these people have never held a gun in their life. When they heard that you managed to get the Torians and Krogan to cooperate, that was a shot in the arm, Shepard. Of the one thing we're in short supply around here. Faith. That any of us will live to see another day. How bad is it? It could be worse, but not much. Can you still coordinate any kind of counterattack? We're hitting the Reapers every chance we get. Mostly guerrilla style hit and runs. But it's not enough. It's time we started focusing our efforts. Where? London. Something big is happening there. Our networks in the UK say the Reapers have arrived in huge numbers. I don't like the sound of that. Any more details? No. And that scares the hell out of me. Well, the Crucible will scare the hell out of the Reapers. We're counting on it. Oh, and Shepard. I meant what I said earlier about Kai Lang. The Reapers may seem like our biggest threat, but take it from me. Lang is a vicious bastard. Don't underestimate him. Vale. Noted. Then I'll let you get back to it. We need whatever good news you can send our way. And it's enough. Vale. Podría hacer alguna misión, joder. Me dejan. Commander. Pantalla de carga absurda ahí, mira. Quiero hablar con los cuarianos. En la ciudadela tengo una misión. Puede ser. Sí, tenía que hablar con los refugiados. Joder, es verdad. Ay. No, y esto, esta, esta, esta pantalla me parece tan vaga. Uf. Que es súper vago hacer esto, una pantalla ahí para que te lleve al sitio donde tú quieres. But you could catch a few quick shots for me. There are lots of refugees on the rest of the Citadel. It won't have the same impact as seeing crowds trapped on the docks. We all need to help each other. I want this documentary to shock people into action. Vale. Good idea. The galaxy should see what these refugees have been through. Thank you, Commander. That's exactly what I'm hoping for. If you could just take a few shots with your Omni tool in the refugee camp, I'll be here when you're done. Mm 
I recovered your pillars of strength from the kite's nest. They're yours, waiting in Bay D-24. Thank you. Right now, my people need any reminder of that faith they can get. Welcome to Vitarian State Arms. Please observe all cast restrictions when making a purchase. Batarian State Arms. Defending the hegemony. Vale, ¿por qué no? Stand strong for your people with Batarian State Arms. Stand strong for your people with Batarian State Arms. Your purchases are a credit to the hegemony. James? <laughs> Se está haciendo un tatuaje. What brings you down here? I was about to ask you that. Well, after our little chat, I made up my mind. I'm going to join the N7 program. And you're celebrating by getting a tattoo? <laughs> sort of. See, there's no official channels to go through right now. So, I guess this is my way of making it official. Technically, I'm just an N7 recruit, but, you know, I figure with you as my training officer, how could I fail? Right? I'm flattered, but I wouldn't exactly say I'm training you. Not officially, but what the hell is in this goddamn war? I'm just saying, whether you like it or not, you're my direct superior and you're N7. So I take my lead from you. And you know, I'll take whatever advice you got. Really? Sure. The good advice. Well, they wouldn't ask you if they didn't think you could handle it. Here's hoping. But the real work starts now. Uh-huh. I know it seems like I don't take things seriously, but when I commit to something, I fully commit. Clearly. Hey, I won't let you down. The only person you need to prove yourself to is the one standing in the mirror every morning. Good point. You know, that's gonna sting for a few days. You gonna be ready for duty? Always. Hey, maybe we should get matching. You want me to get an N7 tattoo? N7? Sure. Or you could get my name done somewhere special. You're such a tease, Vega. Who, me? You ever gonna make good on all this flirting? Uh, I was just... I didn't mean to... You know... Cojones. I was just... <laughs> That's what I thought. Later, Lieutenant. Later. Ah! Careful! No se ve el tatuaje. <laughs> ¿Qué coño tiene la misma voz de Garrus? No lo entiendo. No hay más voces para los turianos, coño. In my experience, the Alliance looks out for their own. Trust is a hard thing to come by these days. I know you need our military supplies, but they're worth far more than your basic meds. Her offer wasn't satisfactory. Your people need our supplies, and my people need every edge we can get. Your combat-grade meds will make a difference. And our mission may just save everyone. Now's not the time for pettiness or mistrust. With our day-to-day -day worries, it's easy to forget we are all in this together. I'll have my people contact yours. You'll have your supplies as soon as possible. Ya está. Great shot, Commander. Montón de sitios vacíos que no representan nada. I've assumed full control of Eclipse, and we're committed to moving forward with Arya. Extranet says you're Alliance military. Take care of yourself out there, officer.
Listen, please, we just need more food. I can give you the location of some ruins. Prothean ruins on Gay Hinnom in the Hades Nexus. Vale. If you could get past the Reaper patrols, I'm sure you'd find something valuable. That's got to be worth something. Please, my family is starving. Vale, pues vamos. Vale. I have your footage. Thank you, Commander. I'll start editing it right away. Thank you, Commander. I'll start editing it right away. Admiral Steve Admiral David Edward Major K Garrus Vakarian is a noted Vale, vamos a ir al presidium a ver ¿Qué encontramos? Oh, está todo en la mierda. Ya, no me interesa ahora mismo comprar armadura. Security bids bring me a warrant. You're stonewalling me? Those bids could be vital for the war effort. I doubt the Reapers have agents doing business in my cafe. We're trying to protect you. 
Tell the job you do. See those scorch marks? Cerberus killed one of my servers right there. Where were you? Hey, I lost friends too. If you care about... We're at war. If you care about the safety of the Citadel, you'll help CSEC however you can. Thank you, Commander. I have some high-profile customers. If word gets out that I'm ratting them out to CSEC... You think I care about insider trading or electronic smuggling right now? I'm after the bastards who attacked the city. Nobody else. We've got my... All right. Just... I hope it helps. Hey, Kaiden. Mandas un cafelito. This place can still get supplies for a menu like this. Maybe it's better if we don't ask how or where. I'm glad we're taking the time to do this. I could use a sanity check. Things have been pretty crazy. You know, my life flashed in front of my eyes on Mars. And there weren't enough moments like this with people I care about. How are you feeling these days? Feeling up to whatever the Reapers throw at me. And grateful that I convinced you to sit down for half a second and relax. Yeah. I think it's a good time for us to have a heart-to-heart. -heart. What are you drinking? <laughs> if you're trying to butter me up, it might take a nice steak sandwich, too. So? Shot of whiskey and a good old Canadian lager. Think they have it? More likely to have Batarian shard wine. At my parents' place in Vancouver? <laughs> Drank more than a few beers on their balcony, looking over English Bay. Yeah. Beautiful view. You know what, though? I feel good about our chances. Yeah? Yeah. Lets me sleep better at night. You're not sleeping, Caden? Maybe a little restless. The war isn't the only thing keeping me up at night. I wonder about us. Us? I, um... I have feelings for you, Shepard. Ah, I'm, todo el mundo igual. I want more. I want to understand what this is between us. And make it real. That's what I want. <laughs> what do you want? I'm sorry, Caden. But we should just keep it professional. Right. Mm. Well, not the answer I was hoping for. Times are... Complicated. Oh, I understand. That's okay. So, uh, when does that steak get here? Uh, incidentally, you better be buying now. What'd you call it? A sanity check? Mmm. Sanity check. Hmm. <laughs> Pero digo que Idan. Que estaba cola hijo. Commander, unless you can find a new source of weapons for CSEC, I'm putting together a task force to stop the Blue Suns myself. I'll get you your weapons, General. I appreciate the effort, but I've spent too much time out of action, Commander. Won't be able to sit on my hands much longer. kept digging a few hours longer, we'd have gotten the obelisk of Karza. I know the Hades Nexus is off limits. I'm not an idiot. Vale, otra misión. The obelisk of Karza was supposed to contain Protean language translations, like the Rosetta Stone for Proteans. Think of how much it could have helped us understand. Welcome to Karza Fabrication Weaponry. Bueno, si lo compro aquí sale más barata, la verdad. Bueno, mal que tengo dinerete de sobra. La coraza sí la voy a comprar. La armadura es que tampoco la voy a usar. You need to hear this. Oh, Blue Rose of Ilium. If these humble words reach you, then I have joined my ancestors. No. No, no, no. My dream was to be by your side. A weed beside your beauty. 
twining together in the warm chunk of sun. Oh, Char. But if my last days must be with Krant instead of kindness, still I will remember the perfume of your scent and the soft touch of your petals. Let my broken bones build a wall around your garden so you and the flower we planted together can grow safe and strong. Thank you. Uh, I should... I need to go. Tenía un mensaje ahí desde hace mucho. Lo compro todo. Me lo llevo todo, 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 Jordan Knowles, E Crimes. It's an honor to meet you, Commander. I've got a saboteur hacking key systems, power, communications. It's bad. If you've got time to help, check out this console. Got it. Looks like a collection of access codes. They're Batarian diplomatic codes from back when they had an embassy on the Citadel. If you can use your Spectre access to find them, I can shut them down. I can access restricted intel at the Spectre office in the embassy. Vale. Everyone on the Citadel knows we're at war now. You have to show them that Caesar. The commander's right. We need people coming into work every day. We need things to keep running. Otherwise, today's bar fight could be tomorrow's street riot. Yeah, maybe you're right. This feels so damn petty right now. Todo el mundo ha perdido la cabeza. ¿Qué coño pasa? I couldn't help but overhear your conversation. Maybe these heating stabilizer schematics could help. This is amazing. The colonists, my sister, will be most pleased. Thank you. I am in your debt. I just don't understand why you're suddenly so conflicted. Look, the asshole's in custody now. Killing him won't bring anyone back. What's going on here? I'm in position at CSEC. Draw them away, and I'll move in and make the kill. Don't answer that. What? Bomb or turret? How many this time? 
can clear the area until you These are control schematics for Cerberus turrets. Will these help? Damn right they will. I'll have E-Crimes dig into them. Might even help us find the little present Cerberus left for us. Thanks a lot. This is gonna save lives. De nada. Vamos a, dar, a hablar con el capullo este. Vaya que nos la lié. Si no, no lo tenemos que cargar. Commander Shepard. I was just contacted by a black market dealer who's donating high-end weapons to CSEC. He wanted you to know. Sounds like you came through. And the Blue Suns can go about their business. Now we'll be focusing on Citadel defense. It won't bring Palavan back, but it's something. Thank you, Commander. Y ya está. Ya por misiones que tengo aquí, joder. Además estaba en el mismo puto pasillo. Vale, vamos para la oficina. No sé qué había por aquí, a ver si veo algo. Nada. No, the Krogan are the only race that can fight on the toxic world, so they need support. Well, ideally, something like a cactiosaur. They're good in mountains, immune to toxins, ferociously loyal to their riders. Yes, they'd be ideal. Unfortunately, they were driven to extinction during the Rachni War. So, unless we can engineer something new, Krogan on toxic worlds will have to fight on foot without support. De cojones está mi oficina. Pues por aquí. Ah, esa es la embajada. So many pieces to put back together since the Cerberus attack. We're reeling from the implications. Udina in league with Cerberus trying to murder the Council. These are dark days for all of us. All that time you were working for Udina, did you ever suspect? Always rubbed me a little wrong. Still, that traitorous bastard upped me. Probably made me for an idiot. <laughs> I guess I proved him right. He's dead and you're still here, Bailey. <laughs> Thanks to you. If you hadn't shown up, Odina and Cerberus would be dancing on my grave. Thought you'd be in the hospital. If I'm breathing, I'm working. Probably the worst I've ever been hurt. Fitting, I guess, given the state of the galaxy. But if Cerberus thinks a few slugs is gonna keep me out of action, they've got another thing coming. No time for rest. Good luck, Bailey. Yeah, you too, Shepard. Vale. Está cerrado. 
Desde lo de, de Udina, porque es tonto. Claro, tengo que meterle una bala en la cabeza, porque es que el tío era más corrupto que la hostia. Ay, vamos a ver qué tengo en la, en la terminal. Vale. Hey Shepard. I have to admit, everyone's walking around in a daze. Or in my case, limping. And I wonder if we'll ever be the same. These are dark days for all of us. You got your work cut off. You and me. Vale, a ver si encuentro la, la residencia del tío este, que se supone que estaba por aquí, pero. ¿Encuentra tú algo en el pasillo este? Es que no puede ir a ningún sitio, tío. A ver si encuentro al refugiado este. Pressure's okay. No infection so far. Can I talk to him? Only if it's important, Commander. He's hurt bad. Take down the sedative a bit, but hurry. I peg his survival at 50-50. Are you Gorak? <sighs> Even what a terrorist is doing on the Citadel? You! Do I know you? <coughs> Every Batarian with someone on Eratok remembers your face. La luna que reventamos para la cargarnos. <coughs> Exacto. You butcher the colony. Only regret. <coughs> Don't have the strength to. I destroyed Eratot's relay to stop the Reapers from pouring through. Ha! Easy for you to claim now that they're here. Don't pretend you have any remorse. You think I didn't feel guilty? I destroyed a colony. I've thought about the people who died, about how I couldn't warn them in time. In the end, I didn't have a choice. But I'm sorry, if that means anything. If you're so remorseful, <coughs> do you have any real guilt? 
truth for mercy. <laughs> Unplug this machine. Let me join my family. Genial, me acaban de dar 5.000 créditos por eutanasiar a un señor, ¿vale? Eh, no sé yo esto BioWare, ¿qué coño pasa? Que eh, vale, que el tío estaba sufriendo y tal, pero también era un terrorista de cojones. Y eh, bueno, vamos a dejarlo por aquí, ¿vale? En el siguiente episodio, pues a ver si hacemos más misioncillas y tal. Y nada, nos vemos en el siguiente vídeo. Like por si os ha gustado y suscribiros si no lo habéis hecho ya. Hasta el siguiente vídeo. Adiós.